Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. In this video, I'm going to have a quick look at some of the new features in the updated Microsoft Band, and particularly around the messaging. So let me open an email. Um, a lot of these will come in uh, spam ones, but uh, you'll get the idea. So I've tapped the, the action button there, and uh, then it gives you a preview of what the mail looks like. So before you can only see the subject, but now you can actually see the, the message as well. And it looks a bit odd, but it's enough to get a gist of the message and, and decide whether you need to actually open your, uh, your phone to have a look at the message as well. But uh, I, I find that really helpful and, and is uh, very useful. Now, the other thing you can do is you can actually reply to messages. So I can, uh, I can read that message like I did before. Uh, that was just a short message. I can reply and I can uh, use Cortana or I can use a keyboard. This is a test message. And there you go, there's Cortana to that message. So, a really quick, easy way of replying to a text message that previously would have required you to get your phone out, and Cortana is great for that. Now the other thing you have got is an on-screen keyboard, so I can type a, a word, swipe across, and you see it's put the word in there. Now it could be that I mistyped the word, and I can choose the other word instead. Uh, so what would appear to be a difficult um, on-screen keyboard is actually quite useful. Uh, so I can do hello. And then you can see I didn't quite get it because I didn't actually do the H. So I can go there. So now let's actually do it. And it's got haptic feedback, so I know that I didn't do the H because it didn't vibrate. So. That's better. And there it is. So, like I said, you can use the text or you can use the um, or you can use the on-screen keyboard. And I actually quite like the on-screen keyboard. So those, that's the new features of the, the band. There are other things in here as well such as a, the web version of the app, the health app, um, which you can have a look at. I'll include that link in that in, with, along with the video. And there's now an SDK as well so developers can act, create new apps and there's also this cycling app on there as well. So those are the main changes of the band and I can't wait to see what developers do with the SDK. So more band stuff on the digitallifestyle.com and you can see all our videos and other stuff on our YouTube channel.